But for that we get 2875 gil, 4300 experience! Cecil still doesn't gain a level though. And we get the defense sword for our trouble. That is going on Cecil damn near immediately. Alright, so we got uh, 99 attack, right? With uh, 40, 24, 36, and not 7 times multiplier. 40, 24, 36, 7. Are you going to remember that? Because <laughs> I probably won't. Once again, I guarantee nothing. 124, and his defense goes up by 7. That is quite an improvement. It actually has defense, what do you know? Uh, his vitality definitely went up. I forgot what it was before, but it definitely wasn't 51. So he overall has more defense and all that good stuff now. So we are done here. We need to head over here, and... We've made it to basement floor four? <gasps> basement four? Right here, you came back, of course she did. Why wouldn't she? Let's grab the ether one out of there. This is the land of uh, summoned monsters. Or, I guess monsters, I guess you could say. Our king resides deep in this world. That's a scary thought. We are the monsters, and this is our world. Callers can summon us to your world. Are you any good? You want to work for me? I'll pay you money. Works for Yojimba, right? So let's go all the way around here. You're the first humans to visit here other than Rydia, of course. I'm special. I'm super special. And awesome like that. So let's go here. There's kind of a trick to this one. Kind of. The Town of Monsters. You go back through and now you can grab this treasure chest that you couldn't get before. And here we find the rat's tail. Wonder what that's for. <laughs> Surely nobody knows. What do you? Hi, Radio. That's all you gotta say. What's up, Chocobo? How you doing? Ch Ch Chocobo. Hi, Radio. What? Is it strange if I talk a little bit, a little bit. I do think that I need items and stuff. What are you guys talking about here? Chocobo, Shiva, and Indra. They all live here in the land of summoned monsters. Titan is only a blockhead if you can use the magic spell of float. Yeah. If you use Float, Titan can't hurt you. That's what he's trying to say. It just came out funny. I guess Jin is burning as usual, huh? Yes, Ifrit is burning, whatever. Uh, what do we have here? Nothing all that great, but I do believe that I need some of those things. So I'm going to rest at the end and buy some items off screen. Okay, I'm actually good on items. Don't need to get any more. However, I need, as you can see there, there are some treasure chests that I did miss. Because the only way to get down there is through here, I believe. Now, where is it? It's around here somewhere. Go. Yes, go away. Is it... Hmm. There's definitely a secret passage around here somewhere. Is it over here? It must be over here. Ah, yes! Now I remember, there it is. Just a little hidden teleporter. That takes us up here to these four treasure chests with a samurai arrows. Uh, an elixir, an ether 2, and a samurai bow. That should be a hell of an upgrade for Rosa here. So let's go ahead and put that on her. So we need the samurai arrows. Uh, and then the uh, samurai bow. 89. Jeez, that's a huge upgrade. Uh, for those later versions, samurai translates somehow to Yoishi. How, I don't fully understand. But it does. So, uh, yeah, that's how good of items that we're finding now. I don't understand exactly how this works. But I do like the perspective here. It's kind of backwards though kind of backwards out of my way no you went the wrong way damn it up oh, there we go why aren't those chests now opened I opened those chests right this world is ruled by master of monsters we have a queen named Azura bye Azura okay let's go into the armor shop then yes of course 
Rhydia, you've done wrong by sending people here. Oh, damn. Those are good. Those are damn good. You can get two of those and, and I'll equip them. And I'll sell off what I don't need. With that done, I didn't bother getting the uh, the shield for for Cecil or for, for Kane. It's kind of expensive, not that big of an upgrade to be honest with you. I heard... Uh, our friends are not behaving themselves. Of course not, you monsters. Okay, we have to beat the queen in order even to speak to the king. That doesn't sound good at all. What do you have in your weapon shop? Yes. Yes, everybody's so happy to see Rydia, apparently. Uh, so let's go ahead and buy her the Blitz Whip. I should put her on the whip. I know I, the, the change rod has been doing work for me, but... I should move her over the long sword. Uh, I'm not sure. Ooh, charm could work. That could work. All right, hold on while I just double check these. Okay, I ended up going with uh, this setup. <laughs> I ended up getting the the blitz ch blitz whip for Rydia. I almost call it a chain whip. It's not a chain whip. I ended up going for the Lunar Staff because it increases Rose's uh, will by 10. I believe it's will. It's the last one. Yeah, will by 10, so it's up to 58, and that should help her with white magic. Uh, I did uh, I did also buy the Charm Arrows. I bought 99 of those just in case. I also bought the uh, Charm uh, Rod in case, once again, I want to switch it out and use it for, for Rydia because Rosa, of course, can't use it. And then, Edge, I did not buy the long sword. The ninja sword is better. If you want to dual wield, that's fine, but I'd rather keep him in the back row because his, his defense is so weak right now that I'm just going to keep the boomerang on him. That is the setup that I'm going for. So, let us head up here. I have talked to you. Really, that is a big path that only one person can go through. Uh, I believe I've gone in there. Yes, we are friends. Maybe I haven't. Chuck was just hanging out. This is the library. At least you spelled it properly. Library, of course. Uh, yes, we have to be quiet. Can I read the books? Indra is slow to anger, but when he does, his wrath will strike down offenders with a terrible lightning. She was the queen of ice. Those who dare her... Wait, what? Queen? It totally looked like a guy this time. Whatever. Shiva, the queen of ice, those who anger her will be frozen to the bone. Chocobo is the best of the summon monsters as far as quickness, flight, and cuteness. Yeah, the Chocobo kind of sucks. Legend tells us of the art of summoning unbeknownst to all. Ooh. Jin, the burning master, his flame is said to consume everything it touches. Titan, the king of giants, his power can crack the earth and most foes will be swallowed into it unless we cast float. One must be strong in body and mind to pass the cave leading to the world of humans. The history of our land traces back to the past when humans did not exist. The art of summoning. Now there are only a few humans left alive to wield that power. There's a naming way over there should you want to use him. There are countless books in here in this library. You will never find it boring. Really? Sylphs. The gentle frail, they can unite their power together and unleash a potent magic. Odin, a knight with a sharp blade, he was beaten only once when lightning struck his sword. So there is Odin in this place. Our master, referred to by humans as the master of oceans, he is a ruler of might. Azura, our queen, she is the Queen of our master and the gateway to his audience. Those who beat her will be able to see the true form of our master. The law. True strength lies in the just mind. Test a collar before you answer the summon. Test? There's no test. <laughs> Do you have literature? Yes, we have literature. I can't read this one. Really? That one's hidden. Nobody can see that one. The two moons. It is said only one moon shone upon the primeval earth. Our true master, the king of the summoned monsters, created us. He watches over us from afar. The only way to beat him is to reflect back his power. So far, though, no one has succeeded. Really? Didn't, didn't we already learn 
reflect. That's where we did. Is it Rosa that learned reflect? It must be Rosa then. Yeah, she learned it. We got it. Don't you worry about that. Cost a fortune, but we got it. Summon monsters, humans, and monsters from where they came from and where they will go, we cannot know. Long ago, great whale descended from the moon? What is this, South Park? It is sleeping inside of a dragon now. That totally makes sense. Where does this take us? Oh, I don't like the looks of that at all. I just wanted to go over here. Wizards with the power of summon monsters of the righteousness. Uh, that looks like the king and queen to me, and that's not exactly where I wanted to go just yet. There was one more place that I wanted to go. Apparently that was in the basement. The king and queen hang out in the basement of the library? Yes, we've, we've gone over that. Glad to see you back. I don't think I went into these places up here. We have. Don't go again. No, we can never leave. We have to get the life potion and the heal potion first, of course. Then we are free to leave. And I don't believe I went to... Oh, that's the item shop. But if you saw, there is a save point in there. Which means that's going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy IV. I have been Bala Scuba. I have been joined, as always, by my faithful squad of Rydia Kane, Rosa, Cecil, and Ed. When we come back, we will talk to the queen, king and queen. Why am I doing this after this? After saving and all that good stuff? Because, as you said, they want to test us and I'm not ready for any kind of quiz so I hope you guys have enjoyed these parts hope you laughed hope you learned hope to see you next time thanks for watching <laughs>